I'm Stephanie Salvatore and welcome to Ask the Expert. I'm here with Dr. Stephen Olbaum of Olbaum and Waterman Eye Associates and today's topic is, is infant eye exams. The reason that we want to examine an infant is to look for major things wrong such as a misalignment of the two eyes, any very large vision problem, or a big difference between the eyes that could lead to a lazy eye or any serious health problem with the eyes. Is there something a parent can look for that they would know to bring their infant to an eye doctor? Some signs of a serious eye problem is if you notice a white pupil, the center of the pupil in each eye should normally be black with a clear covering over the outside of it. If you notice a, a white pupil instead of a black pupil, that's certainly a sign of something being wrong. If you notice your child avoiding use of one eye or either eye turning in or out, anything like that. And what do you use to check to see if the infant's vision is correct? The test that we're going to do, we're going to use a few different types of lights to make sure the eyes looked that they're aligned with each other. Secondly, we can use lights to shine into their eyes that get, can give us an estimate of their prescription to find out if they're nearsighted or farsighted or have astigmatism without them answering any questions about it. And still other types of lights to look inside their eyes to make sure that everything is healthy on the inside of their eyes. If parents want to learn more about the Infant C program, what was the website that they can go to? It's Infant C, that's infantsee.org. It's a national organization that gives a wealth of information about infant vision and infant eye exams, and I urge people to check it out. Dr. Olbaum, thank you for being with us today. And for more information, you can visit us at cnyhomepage.com and go to Dr. Olbaum's page there. And we will see you next week.